Hello everyone, I am the Raping Unicorn and in this video I shall show you how to download and install Third Age Total War. It is a very awesome mod and I highly recommend it to anyone. It is amazing. Alright, so you're gonna go to Google, search Third Age Total War. You're gonna click Third Age Total War Mod DB. And it's gonna take you, oh boy, take you here. So what you're gonna do is just scroll down to the links here. You're gonna download all of them one by one, chill, unless you have epic internet. So you wanna, so it's gonna take you to a page like this, each one of the downloads gonna click download and the download will pop up but I cancel it because I already have it downloaded we're gonna do it for each one of them remember and yeah let's move on so you're gonna open your files and you're gonna have your downloads and your downloads folder right below Right below every one of them but I put them here you don't have to put it on the file but I did it anyway because I like not having a mess so yeah these are gonna be on your download folder you're gonna open them one by one on chronological order but I'm not gonna do it like that and yeah let's open them oh and by the way you can only download them on Google Chrome or Mozilla. I downloaded it on Internet Explorer two times and it didn't work. It doesn't work on Internet Explorer. Don't do it there. And also, I have problems with this too. If you lose the internet for like a second, just a second, the download will, when you open this, the, the download will say um, file contains invalid data that's because either your internet didn't wasn't working for like a second and you gotta make sure it has this memory if it has any lower that means you downloaded it wrong and your internet failed you for like a second you gotta make sure you download all of it don't lose your internet for a second so yeah you click this will pop up for each one of them doesn't matter doesn't matter that it's 3.2 and remember it's chronological but I did it this because this one's fast so yeah this is for disk users but since we're steam we're not gonna go there so you're gonna Open this and you're gonna move them to your new folder, your TATW folder, Third Age Total War. You're gonna do it for each one of them 3.0 part 1 and 3.0 part 2. You're gonna click next, next, and start. So you already have it downloaded, so I'm gonna cancel that. So you're gonna do that for each one of them. It ain't that hard. And now what you gotta do is open your Steam. Let me end my Windows. Program Files 86. You're gonna search for Steam. Steam Apps. Common. Medieval 2. You're gonna click mods and wait, let me fix this real quick since I already had it, but I forgot and don't get mad. This does not appear by the way, you gotta copy the third age tree file to the mods folder to tonic. Hmm. Okay, so imagine this is not here, this is not here, guys, just ignore it. I'm gonna show you how to copy this to
to the to mods folder. So you're gonna open your TATW folder where you downloaded everything from those the other downloads. And you're gonna have this. You're gonna click mods and you're gonna move this to here. And one more thing to do, you gotta click data, models missile, you leave it there. You're gonna click your third age file, you're gonna click your data, you're gonna scroll down to models missile, and you're gonna move this here. And since I already have it there, I'm not gonna do that. And I'm not sure if that's obligatory, but yeah. Now what you gotta do is go back to the mods folder. By the way, I don't have British list because I deleted it a long time ago and I don't want to download it back. It's a very boring mod. So yeah, what you're gonna do is rename this to any one of these X mods. What I mean is simply Naming Teutonic to Teutonic 2 and naming this, whoops, okay, naming this to Teutonic there. So you can open it on Steam. And now you're done. All you gotta do is open your Steam, right click and click Teutonic. And that's pretty much it, guys. It's not that hard, just make sure you don't have shit internet for the huge downloads, they take a lot of time. And that's it.